Hello everybody, FoosMC here with an exciting new release for the Crackback. This is put out by Minecraft, uh, Minecraft and it is uh, the predecessor of Feed the Beast, FTB, Minecraft, and they have now moved it to the AT Launcher and done their release. Um, if you don't know how to install the AT Launcher or get the Crackback in the AT Launcher, I just uploaded a video tutorial on how to do that, so take a moment and go check that out. Um, first, what we're going to do is, oh, let me see, let's go to Google, we'll go to a new thing, we are going to go search Optifine, and I got it right there, so it's going to be optifine.net downloads.php. Um, you may have to and uh, download a couple different versions to try them to see which ones work. Um, I've already done this so I am already pretty sure that the download for Optifine 1.6.4 HD D1 works with mine. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and well go ahead and click on that. Um, it gives you an option or it will bring you to the uh, AdFly, sorry. I'm thinking about other things too at the same time. And it'll bring you to this. Okay, so if you skip the ad, this right, none of this right here has anything to do with it. You want this right here. So just click simply on the download, ought to find 1.6.4 HDD1 jar. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and close that out because I have already downloaded that. Okay, now next what we're going to do is we are going to go into Edit Mods. Now you won't actually find it in here because, well, we haven't installed it yet. So what we're going to do is we're going to add a mod. Um, first thing, make sure you select that it is a jar mod. Okay, and we're going to go to Select. Now it's going to bring you into the folder um, for the AT launcher. All right. Um, as you can see, we don't have it in here either. So just make sure I don't have it in here. I went ahead and installed it and just recently uninstalled it so I could do the tutorial. Okay, so we're going to go up, up. As the desktop takes you into your folder. Now go into downloads in your user folder and you will find that in here I have the Optify 1.6.4 HD D1 jar file here. So I'm going to click on that and click open. Alright, that's got it there. We got a jar mod selected. We're going to click add. Alright, now simply check that click on enable mod it's going to move it over now it's not going to be under the O's but if you scroll down to the very bottom you will see it alright so we're going to go ahead and close that um, at this point it's just a matter of clicking play and this will start up we will go ahead and give it a moment to start up I'm really excited about this mod pack and I've already tested it in a test world to make sure that the Optifine works. Everything in it so far does. Um, there are some conflicts in the controls. Um, your best bet in that is to go into the options, controls, and select all. If you go through there, any of the red labeled buttons will indicate conflicts. At that point it's just a matter of whether you want to change it or what else you want to use. So if this doesn't start pretty quick then we'll go ahead and cut it off. But that is basically how to install Optifine for 1.6.4 for the crack pack in use with the AT launcher. And this is going to take a little bit to launch up for everybody. If you get the error message that Minecraft is not responding, then I would actually just let it sit for a minute. Um, usually it does, every time it does, 
that to me and it comes right out of it and goes right into the start screen so well, I'm going to go ahead and say goodbye for now. Thanks for watching. I hope this helped. If it does, please leave a like. If you're interested in other tutorials that I may have done, please go ahead and check out my channel. And if you have any tutorials that you have or would like to request, um, please submit them on my channel on this video or other videos or send me a message. Thanks for watching again. Bye-bye.